This is our flower horn that is gonna be matching up against our male beta fish. Oh yeah, he's ready. Scoop berries out. Three, two, one. What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. It is a windy day here in South Florida and it's been kind of cold lately, but our pond fish are doing perfectly fine. So we've got the heater on it and everything. They're doing great as you can see. All swimming around, all in the driftwood. They have been awesome lately. They've been eating like crazy. We'll post some feeding videos very soon, but still getting them warmed up to all, you know, being in the pond and everything. But in today's video, we are going to see who would win in a battle between a flower horn and a male beta fish. Two very, very fierce, fierce predators. And uh, not, I wouldn't say predators, but they do, they're very aggressive. Both, both of them are very aggressive. They both, uh, you know, don't take lightly to others being in their tank. But um, we're gonna see who would win in a battle. I don't know. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below who you think would win before you watch this video. I don't know. Flower horn or male beta fish. Also guys, just wanted to say really quick, if this video gets a thousand likes, we will try to brood the beta fish again. We've been wanting to do it anyways, but we'll see if you guys want it as well. So if this video gets a thousand likes, we will try to breed them again. We already have everything set up and everything. I don't know if we're gonna use a different male. Maybe we'll use the black charcoal. Uh, beta male that we got in our previous video if you guys want us to use that one Or we can still go with Aries even though he clearly Was a little juvenile in there, you know, it wasn't uh, acting like a big male, but um You guys decide Le leave a comment leave a like let us get there to 1,000 likes see if you guys want to do it But in today's video we have our flower horn downstairs and We want to get our beta fish downstairs as well. We want to just keep packing the tank room with tanks so uh I don't know, I thought it'd be a little fun little challenge to see who would be more aggressive when seeing each other. I don't know. I gotta go with, I don't know, I don't know who I'm gonna go with. So we're gonna stick to the end of this video and you guys are gonna see exactly who would win and who gets more, more annoyed at each other when they actually see each other. So uh, let's hop right into the video and uh, get started. But first, if you're new here, remember to hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, turn it on, and uh, Let's get into the video. See guys, all the pondfish are doing well. Paku's still looking like a giant. Tarpon looks even bigger. But um, yeah, they're all grubbing in here. Having a good time. The sharks are darting all over the place. And Big Jeremy. Our platinum red tail hopefully will be that big very soon because we're feeding him like crazy. And let's go get this beta fish down into the tank room. All right guys, so this is our flower horn that is gonna be ma matching up against our male beta fish, Aries. We gotta go grab him from upstairs really quick, bring him down here, and then we'll get this whole process started. See who's gonna win. I don't know who's gonna win, guys. They're both they're both very vicious. They do not like other fish, so uh, we'll see. I gotta go get that beta fish and bring him downstairs. And here we have it, guys. This is our male beta fish that's gonna be matching up against our flower horn. As you can see, he's beautiful in his tank. He's doing very well, but he did fail in breeding when we tried. <laughs> so this is our male beta fish, and that we want him, we wanna move all these tanks down to the tank room. So we're gonna be moving this beta fish down there today and seeing how he's gonna react when he sees our flower horn. But just a quick update, our platinum red tail is doing absolutely wonderful. As you can see, we just fed him. His stomach is huge right now and he loves to just swim up to the top. I get kind of nervous because I don't want him to just die out and use all of his energy. But um, he's doing great in here. He's eating like a champ. And if you guys go back literally two videos ago, he's already a bigger fish. He's pushing three inches right now. He's pushing three inches for sure. And we got him, he was tiny. And he's literally in two days. That's what's so crazy about these fish. They grow so fast. In two days, he's already bigger, which is absolutely insane. He's honestly my favorite fish that we have. I wanted this fish for so long and I just, I had to do it. But he looks great. The beta looks great. Now we have to get this guy downstairs. Uh, in our tank room and you guys can see we have a shelf that we want to do all beta fish if we can fit them. So uh, we're going to put him, he's going to be the first beta fish in our tank room and on the beta shelf. So uh, let's get him downstairs. So we're going to actually take Aries out of here and put him into this little square glass that we have so that we, you know when we're bringing this tank down and we don't drop it or something and he's inside of it, you know, just in case. So we're going to move him in here for now and he's going to meet his little, his friend, his partner in the tank room. but. First, we gotta get him out, get this tank downstairs, and you guys will see how it looks. Now we're gonna scoop a little bit of water into this. Net out Aries with this little net. Is that enough? A little more? A little more, a little more, if you can. That thing fits so perfectly in there. Fill that up, scoop out Aries. Yeah. Let's see what happens here. Let's scoop this guy out, bring him downstairs. 
Perfect. And there he is, guys. There he is. And it's, you know, it's quite sad that uh, most beta fish will spend their lives in something like this. We're happy that we have Aries, and uh, at least that's one more beta fish that uh, we, we need keep a chance. in a nice big house instead of just, just a little glass jar. But we're gonna bring him downstairs, see how, see how he reacts. Jack's carrying the okay. big tank. I'm carrying the little tank with Aries in it. Let's get him into his new home. Aries is going into his new home, the tank room, baby. Uh, he's gonna be the second fish in our tank room. He's gonna be the first beta fish, and this will be his shelf right there. If the tank fits, that is prime. Let me move this, and let's see. He fits. It literally fits perfectly. Would you look at that, guys? The tank fits literally. Oh. You struggling? Yeah, a little bit. The tank fits literally perfect along this little shelf here, so uh, that gives us some ideas, guys. If you want some more beta fish in this channel, that's a perfect spot for them, so let us know down in the comments. We only want amazing, awesome looking beta fish, so uh, let us know some cool ones down below. Comment them, the names, so I can look them up, see which ones are really cool, that uh, we'll decide if we want to get them, but look at that tank, right on the shelf. Gonna you know, have to hide the wire. We could easily do three. three more for sure, or three, just flat. Three or four on this wall would look so good. It'll be our little personal beta shelf, and uh, that's his tank. So now, now to the juicy stuff. They need to fight. Let's get him. Let's get him. All right, this flower horn is right. fired up right now, and he is ready to battle his. Oh yeah, he is ready. He is ready to battle his uh, beta fish friend over here. They, we will see, we're gonna get to the bottom of this. Who is the tougher matchup, okay? Flowerhorn's definitely got the weight advantage. <laughs> beta fish got the speed, not gonna lie. They, they're a little darty, you, yeah, know? They, they, you know? So it's power versus speed, you know? So now it's all about timing. Who's gonna get the timing right? I don't know, we're gonna have to see. Now it's this beta time. fish, it's time to battle. It's the fight of the century right here. This is, the fight. This is what you've all been waiting for. A beta fish fight, okay? Tie this guy up. Okay. Yeah, yeah. He's he's in the Come corner, on. but he's ready at sometimes. Yep. Come on. I think he'll get fired up as soon as he sees this guy. So yes. Scoop Aries out. We're putting him in the this tank, be... guys. We're putting him in the flower horn tank. Oh my god. I think they're actually gonna be friends. There he is. Three, Three two, one. Sorry. <laughs> you guys really thought we'd do that? <laughs> Aries, we got is. Butt kicks. <laughs> yeah. We're not that dumb. Yes. You guys, we know. We're gonna put this guy in. It was just one way of making a video of putting in Aries into the tank room. We didn't want to just say putting our beta in there, but we got a little fun out of it. We're actually gonna put him up against the tank because we just we weren't gonna actually put him in the tank, guys. You guys it's crazy. We love this beta fish. So we just want to see how they were gonna react with each other and see who would win in a battle right now. Wow. I don't think <laughs> Aries looks so funny through the jog. Yeah. I mean, not Aries. Uh, Arnold? Yeah. Arnold's just chilling. He's not even caring. I don't even think he cares. I think they would have been boys. I think we could have put him in there. Oh, whoa. Oh, now Aries. Aries, Aries is getting angry. I think Aries is taking the taking the championship right now. He's the one doing work. He's getting angry. Yeah. Look at Arnold. Arnold's, Arnold's just sitting Arnold's there. Arnold's not phased whatsoever. Wow. Wow. I did not think that this would happen. Aries is officially the champion of the world. He is. Our beta fish has defeated the flower horn. He doesn't even, the flower horn didn't even have thought. The flower horn looked a little slow and a little, uh, little stunned there. Look, he's just stunned in the corner, you know? He's lost. Guys, beta fish, champions of the world. Champions of the world. Everyone go comment down, beta fish champion of the world. And hashtag Fun. birds or reptiles. Yes, hashtag birds or reptiles. Hashtag Aries is the one and only champion. Now let's get this guy in his tank so you guys can really get the vibe of our two tanks so far in this tank room. And we have some big news coming next week about our other tanks, but uh, stay tuned for that about next week. Then we'll talk about it. But big news coming for this tank room. You ready? Yes. All right. Welcome, Aries. Second fish, second tank. This is kind of hard. Here we go. Second fish and second tank in the tank room. And bam, he's back to his natural, natural spot. Put this on here. And Beautiful. yep, he's back. He's back after he just defeated the flower horn in battle. He's going to, you know, chill in the back, rest up for his next big fight. I'm not <laughs> sure his next, I'm not sure who he's fighting next, guys. Leave a comment down below who do you think he'll battle. But he clearly won the stare down by far. Clearly. So, uh, that's our champion of the day, Aries Arnold, second place. It's not bad. It's not bad to be second, okay? 
Second is the best. Exactly. All right, guys. So that is it for today's video. The fish battled. Aries won. And uh, that is it for this week's video. We will see you guys next week on Sunday. So stay tuned for that. Big week coming next week with the tank room. So uh, we'll see you guys next week. Peace.